Ready ka na ba? Anak? Ready ka na ba, Zozo? <laughs> Tara na! Welcome to my channel. My name is Tiffy Lagman and of course for today's video, we're going to go to the grocery because uh, syempre wala nang stock <laughs> sa pantry and we need to ayan, we need to buy ingredients for uh, the food that I'm going to cook later. Nagpasama ako kay baby ng grocery today. Si Hobby ay maraming ginagawa at si Zach ay nasa school today because uh, today it's Monday so just in case na upload ko to mga after few days after past and dito ako ngayon nagsushortcut ako ayan yung ano kikita nyo ba yan ang laki laki ng, ng, ng bahay na yan grabe as in isang isang block siya so nakikiraan lang po kami dito hindi po dito kami nakatira pero yung mga pangarap kong bahay Nandito sila. Nandito sila actually. Okay, so today, uh, I'm going to cook. Ano ba yan? Nakikita niyo ba yung mga baby bangs ko? Nagsisisulputan na sila. Sabi nila, pag uh, yung baby tumungtong na ng mga 6 months, dati as in nakalbo yan, as in wala. Kaya ang laki-laki ng noo ko, parang pwede nang, ano, pwede na akong kunin ng Clark Airport. <laughs> Landingan ng aeroplano dito. And, Ayan, nagsisitubuan na sila again yung mga baby bangs ko. Good, good naman. Kasi, you know, malaking aking mukha. And, <laughs> para pang padagdag yan ng, ano, ng contour sa mukha, ba? Hinihintay ko lang, lang silang bumaba kasi sobra ang dami nila. And, pataas eh. Ayan, bago kami mag-grocery, kakain muna ako ng konting snack. Okay? Bakit ako kakain ng konting snack? Guys, di maganda mag-grocery na gutom. Lalong mapapadami ang bibilhin nyo. Na kahit na hindi nyo naman kailangan talaga, immediately or urgent, mapapabili ninyo, promise, pag gutom kayo. So, kakain lang kami after ng snack. And then, we're going to head to the grocery. I'll see you guys later. Nag-iisip ako kung bibili ako ng wine. Meron pa ako sa bahay kaya lang hindi ko alam kung bibili ba ako or Hi guys, so nandito na ako sa bahay and I just decided to make um, dinner na lang instead of lunch kasi total kompleto kami during din din and of course while waiting for the pasta to cook konting dessert wine lang para pang relax guys cheers tayo uh, tonight I will be cooking a very uh, easy recipe that I will be sharing you guys and ang tawag ko dito is uh, pasta casserole <laughs> kasi sa casserole ako siya iluluto <laughs> anyways um, I will be giving you the ingredients and I will be showing you how to cook it it's very very easy very 
madali lang siyang i-prepare at uh, madali lang din yung mga ingredients. So, in less than one hour, tapos na yung dinner ninyo. So, heto na ang mga ingredients na meron ako. So, meron akong Italian style uh, spaghetti sauce. Uh, kasi dito sa sauce na to, meron na siya agad with basil, oregano, and flavor of parmesan. Ayan, meron akong minced carrots. Half kilo ng half kilo ng ground beef. Ayan, I also have medium size carrots chopped. Meron akong cheese, butter in nor cubes. And for the pasta, it is already cooked by instruction. I use fusilli pasta. You can also use penne or ziti. But ganito, but hindi spaghetti. It's really up to you. But kasi, ang ziti, gusto ko siya kasi kumakapit yung beef. It stays huh, sa beef niya. I mean, it stays yung beef sa pasta when you eat it. So, you know guys. Yun lang yan. So, let's start cooking. So, I use uh, canola oil. Wala kong olive oil. Sorry guys. Very usually, dapat um, olive oil ang gagamitin. I already put the onion. And then, stir. Okay, I will be putting 2 tablespoon of butter. Lose it lang natin kasi nasusunog yung onion. Ayan, so nasusunog ang onion. And lose lang natin. And wala akong minagay na garlic again because I would like, I do not like the pasta to taste garlicky. Ang garlic pwede yan sa bread. Ayan. So, let us stir it in when translucent na to we will add on the so yan I already added the ground beef and then you, ha you just have to stir it and let it sit for a while pag medyo brown na siya okay na siyang lagyan ng ibang ingredients so guys, kung makikita nyo, ang ingay na <laughs> ng aso. No joke lang. Uh, I put 2 tablespoons of, or 2 slices of butter in. Hinahalo ko ito. Ito sa fusili. Ayan. Hinahalo ko siya sa fusili. Uh, yung isa nasa baba na habang ito ay hot pa. It added taste to the pasta. Ayan. So may, may, may trick dito. Dapat yung pasta nyo laging al dente. But, kunyari, nakalimutan ninyo siya. Uh, medyo lumambot siya. Just rinse it off with cold water. Na mabilis lang. Kasi it would take off the... Yung, yung oil nung pinapakuluan nyo siya. So, just be careful in rinsing your pasta. Pag, ayan, pag lumagpas kayo dun sa time na al dente siya. So, pwede na pa naman siyang i-redeem. Pwede niya pa siyang paraanan. Pero guys, as much as possible, don't let it na ma-overcook yung pasta ninyo. Okay, so when the ground beef is brown, you can add up the carrots. Ayan. So, guys, if gusto niyo ng konting crunch pa dun sa carrots niyo, uh, paunahin niyo yung ground beef na ilagay. Ayan. And then, but, if Gusto nyo na parang wala yung carrots dyan. Mauna ang ground. Uh, I mean, mauna yung carrots before the ground beef. Okay, guys. So, let's add on the beef bouillon. Bouillon or beef cubes. Ayan. And just here. Woo! <laughs> let's add up the tomato sauce. Or Italian style tomato sauce. Ayan, lagay natin lahat. By the way, this is 500 grams. So, everything 500 grams. Pasta, um, beef, and then yung sauce. But if you want it to be saucy, ayan, dagdagan nyo ng another 250 grams. Okay lang yan. Okay. And then, we're gonna stir it. Alright guys, so uh, we are simmering the sauce and then, so, uh, kasi 
actually gusto ko na siya yung taste niya nung tinikman ko siya pero just in case guys if you wanted to uh, taste a little creamy I'm adding up cheese kasi may bata kami sa bahay so but then bag, pag, kung ako lang ang kakain guys gusto ko na yan uh, medyo tangy yung lasa pero syempre kids are kids so let's put cheese so we are stirring it um, gradually ayan para lang hindi siya masunog sa baba and let us ano, wait and let the sauce sit and simmer for like about 5 to 7 minutes more with low heat from medium to low heat Ayan. So, syempre, to incorporate everything, all of the ingredients, and para maluto siya ng husto. Ayan. Dahil gabi na, kailangan ang pagkain ay lutong-luto. And, um, syempre, ayan, para bigyan pa na siya ng oras ng konting maluto. It takes time when, it, when cooking, guys. Um, easy siyang gawin. But it is a process and it's something that you don't really want to make a shortcut when it when cooking. Kung gusto mong lumabas siyang masarap. Camera. Like this. You don't, don't drop it, okay? Dito ka lang, basta yan. Okay. Okay, action. So guys, when it's done simmering, I decided to incorporate na yung fusilli pasta with the sauce. It's really up to you guys if you just wanted to top it. Pero ako, ilalagay ko na siya. So, later, isandok-sandok na lang siya. <laughs> Tapos na, and then, kaya nga, ano siya, pasta casserole, because you have to put everything in the casserole. <laughs> To the casserole, ah. Oop! And then, stir muna natin siya, okay? Ayan. Thank you for for my son, Zach, who is now filming it. Because, you know, I only have two hands and my hands are already full. So, thank you, Zach, for very welcome helping show everybody our okay well actually you can turn off your ano na, um, heat para hindi mo overcook yung pasta and let's add everything see what I'm talking about yung ground beef kumakapit siya sa pasta that's why I chose fusilli you can also use penne ziti or any kind of pasta that you like but since it's casserole it's one pot pasta. That's why I chose Fusilli. Yeah, and that's uh, how it looks like in the casserola. So later, when we plate, we're going to put Parmesan cheese. Yeah. Yes. Okay, guys. So, we get natin ang verdict. Kung masarap. Okay, wait. I'm gonna blow it. Because... It's hot. Oh, wait, wait lang. Are you excited? <laughs> okay, taste. Mmm. Mambobola yung coconut ko. Okay, guys. You like it? Yes. You like it? You love it? I love it. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. So that's it guys. Ayan, bukuran pa natin ng parmesan cheese. Ayan, so there you go with the pasta casserole. And uh, if you enjoyed my pasta, uh, of course you can subscribe to my channel. Please do click the notification bell for you to be updated for new videos. And of course, don't forget to follow me at my Instagram and Twitter accounts at Tifilogman. Thank you so much for watching and hope to see you next time. Bye guys!